Hi, it's Jessie with Plan With Jessie, and I wanted to talk to you about my A6 planner setup right now. So, right now I'm using this planner, which I got from Amazon, which the label on it actually says it's a Love Doki, Doki book um, cover, which is weird because the description didn't say that at all. Um, and I just thought it was a, you know, like a faux Hobonichi cover, but I guess it's a Love Doki um, cover. So this is the cover I'm using. I really don't like it um, because the notebook that I have in here, let's see if I can show you, um, along with the, I'm using it as a wallet, so I have cards and ID in there as well, and it just doesn't, um, doesn't stay closed, even when I use um, a, an elastic band, so that's a little bit frustrating. Um, I did order another A6 cover that should be coming soon, so I will show you that when it comes, and that one um, hopefully can handle a little more thickness so I don't have this um, issue. So I did have cards in here, I just took them out so you didn't have to see, you couldn't see those in the video. Um, I have in here a few coupons, uh, receipts I need to take care of, and that's really about it. Um, this is the notebook I'm currently using, it's a hardcover. Uh, essentials brand from Amazon it was about seven dollars and it's actually fine I mean the paper quality is pretty thick um, it's a grid um, it's holding up well so so far it's I mean it's serving its purpose um, so to show you sort of what I've done so far um, so I printed out these monthly um, traveler's notebook um, inserts that I got from is a printable from Growing Up Goddess and I just glued them into um, the notebook using a adhesive roller and this is so almost your birthday um, so here's September which just happened and here's October and here's Myla's birthday she's gonna be five um, so I'm just using this um, monthly layout, which I have made them through the rest of the year. And then I'm just doing daily pages. So I'm trying, so what I'm trying to do is make the daily pages the same layout as what is in this, because I did buy this. This is the Hobonichi 2017 English A6 Techo Planner. And as you can see on the daily pages, the big part on the top is taken for the date, and then this part on the bottom is taken for quote and a little calendar. So I'm trying to test myself to see whether I can keep my daily to-dos within the confines of the space that I'm going to have um, for the Hobonichi to, to make sure that I want to use it before I start writing in here. Because um, if it's not going to work, then I'm going to want to sell it. Um, but I do really like the feel of it. Obviously, I like the paper. That's my main attraction to Hobonichi. So, um, you know, and so far it's working out fine size-wise. I haven't done too many pages in here yet. But as you can see, I'm not using a ton of space. Um, this was before I started making it look like the Hobonichi because it was before it actually arrived. And I didn't know about that space up there. So... Um, I'm not using the full page on any of these pages, except I think this day I had a lot of to-dos. Um, so I guess my two main concerns about um, using this is, will I have enough room on the daily pages? Which it seems like I will. Um, but my question is, where am I going to put other stuff? I was sitting at my daughter's soccer practice the other day and just started making a list of the pumpkin patches in the area. So I could just turn the page and put this in the middle of the daily pages, but where could I do that in here? Um, you just have a couple of pages here for notes, and then it's just the daily pages. And then at the back, you have, I don't know, one, two, three, four, five, six, so 12, um, if you count the backs, 12 note pages. So, you know, what will I do if I want to make a random list that has not, you know, nothing to do with a particular day? I just want to keep track of it. 
So one thing I thought of is maybe just using a second smaller notebook um, with this. So this is just a plain notebook. I think it was from Target. I um, can't remember. I'm thinking it was from the dollar spot at Target, but I can't remember. It might have been Michael's. Um, it just looks like a little cassette. Um, so I was thinking maybe I could just like, tuck this in here. Um, you know, with this next year when the time comes. So I'll have somewhere else to write um, random lists or collections or whatever I want to do. It's just a matter of whether or not I'm going to be able to find a planner that's going to be able to hold two notebooks and all my cards because I do want to use it as a wallet. So that's where I am now. I'm going to keep for the next uh, foreseeable future. <laughs> For the foreseeable future, I'm going to keep doing the daily pages in here, and we'll see how that goes, and if I like it, next year I can go ahead and use this. So that's where, I'm, where my A6 progress is right now. Thanks for watching. Bye.